What up, friends? So you have your herbs now in the closet. And you're like, man, I'm, I'm not going to be using this for a while because I don't have another plant for like another three months. Does that mean this just sits here? Absolutely not, friends. Let's go use our herb now dryer for... Uh, uh, uh... Uh, vegetables and somebody told me there's a fungus among us ah. all right let's get started all right so we have our dryer here and as you see we could just start taking our mushrooms and loading them onto the trays like that and do that all the way around uh do that tray by tray but some of you will remember i had a dehydrator many many years ago where what I did was I went out, bought extra trays, took my snips, and I went through and cut out all of the insides. Trays. Let me show you a beautiful thing about this herb now dryer. You take it, you grab it. You can do that to all of their trays, right? It just pops in and pops right back out. It's very easy. See, look. You put it in. We'll find some arrows. Let's find an arrow. All right. So if we look up top, we see that arrow right there, right? Line up your arrows. Now they're locked. See? Arrow, arrow. Turn it. Tray comes out. Put it in. Lock. So what I'm going to do is pop out all of my trays like so. So what I can do is load up the middle one thing I will say for storage put your trays back in because these don't have a way to interlock and it makes sense I don't know why I would think that they would be so I'm gonna pop all these trays out and then I'll see you guys in a minute so now we're down to the last two and what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna leave that bottom one in there and then we're gonna put the rings back on without our trays To give us essentially a column and then do you want to know what the beautiful part about once you have your column installed all you have to do is take your harvest bowl and dump everything in that you're trying to dry out with this thing running it on herbs it sets to 90 hours I think 96 hours, 90, 96, something like that automatically off of the start. These will not need to be run for so long. So let's bring the camera down a little bit. Boom, there we go. And we'll bring the back down a little bit because professional. Look at that. Look at that. I don't, probably could cut it off right here. Put my dome on. And I'm happy at that point. So actually, yeah, let's do it like that. You know what? No. We're going to put them all on just because I don't want to have to store rings. So now we're going to plug it in. We'll do this little thing. We're just going to hit one off. 96 hours. So uh, that's what we start out at. I'll bring you guys back when it's done and we'll know how long to run it in here. Now, the reason that I'm doing this and that I'm excited about this is this is a lower temperature unit. This runs, I think, at 90 degrees Fahrenheit. Therefore, as this is drying out, it will not add so much heat as to break down our alkaloids faster than we want to break them down. So, this also does not constantly stay on. It's in a purge cycle, so it's on and off. On and off. And that slowing down of movement of air and drying, I believe in theory, will actually help these dry a little bit better. And that will actually give me another good use for my herb dryer. Because I don't want to spend $240 on something and only have one use for it every like uh, 75 days. So with the fungus, that's a weekly thing. So, now I have another use for my beautiful dryer that I fucking paid for. 
So fuck you guys for standing. This is fun to try. No, I pay for this shit. I just also reached out to the manufacturer because I wanted to help you guys out. If you guys want to know, just go down below. You'll get a code with a discount. And then you'll actually get an extra ring. You won't get it with the liner in the middle. You'll get just the ring with the coupon code that you get down there. And that'll come in handy when you're trying to stack your buds. I'll see you guys when we have some more info. Three hours, 20 minutes later, so let's see how we're looking. Spongy. All right, so you see we got 57 hours left, 57 minutes. It's at the point where I would be happy calling it done. Sorry, the light sucks. So, charm them up. And I'll see you then. Well, that's about all I got for you, friends. It's at this point in time I'd like to thank you for your time. It's all we have, and it doesn't exist. Much love. Stay chubby. Uh, you see we got a little sneak peek coming up here, you know, because seems like people forgot you can innovate in the woods with nothing but your brain. So, I already proved the concept. Now you see we're putting it to work at skill. Love you. Bye. Alright, oh, I'll put one more right here. Really push everything in.